Hello, welcome to Drainage Sales. Today I'm going to show you how to connect a waste pipe into a 110mm soil pipe like we've got here. The way we do that is with a fitting called a BOSS adapter and there's two types. There's a rubber one and there's a PVC solvent weld, comes in black or grey. The PVC one, the main difference is that it's not demountable. Once you put that in place and solvent weld it in, it's permanent. Whereas with the rubber one, you've got that much more flexibility, if you excuse the pun, in that you can demount it during installation if you need to and afterwards if you want to remove the waste pipe. The rubber one, which is probably the more popular, comes with lugs on the outside and lugs on the inside and they're for gripping both the Bosch shoulders and for when you push the waste pipe inside it, they grip it nice and tight to stop it from pulling out if there's any stresses on the system. So don't be worried if when you push it in it's a bit tight, it's supposed to be. So the Bosch adapter fits into a Bosch shoulder and there's three types. There's a Bosch shoulder on a standard fitting like a branch and what you would do, you would drill the plastic out there, push the Bosch shoulder in place and push your waste pipe inside, making sure that it protrudes right through inside the soil pipe but not far enough to cause any blockages it just wants to be about probably about a centimeter inside the solvent weld one if you decide to use that you put solvent weld on the inside of the shoulder solvent weld on the outside of the boss put it in give it a twist and then 10 minutes later solvent weld your waste pipe in place there's a boss pipe uh, there's two versions, the short boss pipe which is this one and the most popular, there's also a long boss pipe which is ring seal, the short one is solvent weld both ends and it comes with one boss open and two closed and you drill out these two if you need them. That solvent welds on top of the soil pipe so you normally do this during a new installation and then exactly the same, bring your boss adapter into the side, push your waste pipe in. So that's a boss pipe, and the final way, probably the most popular, is a strap boss. This is a strap boss, and it's exactly what it says it is. It's a boss shoulder with a strap around it. And what you do, again, you put your either solvent weld or push fit your boss adapter into there. This one is ideal for retrofit because if the soil pipe is already in place, just open it, open the strap like that, push it around it. You drill a 54 mil hole, and we have a hole saw to do that job. You put solvent weld around the hole, a little bit of solvent weld around the lug there on the inside of the strap boss, and that little raised lug then fits inside the hole and holds it in place while the solvent goes off. And then you slide that in place and push the clip home nice and tight, and you bring your waste pipe straight into the boss adapter as previously discussed. Just be aware there's a top and a bottom on these because there's a two and a half degree fall just to make sure that you've got a, a little slope for your waste pipe coming in. So that's the three ways of connecting a waste pipe into a uh, soil pipe, all with a boss adapter, but as I say, using either a strap boss, a boss on a existing fitting or a new boss pipe. Hopefully one of those three ways will solve whatever problem you've got or whatever installation you want to do. If you need any more information, there's plenty on the website, www.dronesales.co.uk. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.